now, your live Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Chad Evans. Weather from where you live. Well, we've got a heavy downpour headed for Attica right now. This is live Doppler 18. Of course, Lafayette, West Lafayette here. Notice in the southwest, there's a pretty heavy thunderstorm northeast of Attica. And this one here will likely move right through the city of Attica here over the next half hour with some lightning heavy rain and potentially a little gusty wind in that cell as well. A little uh, thunderstorm also here in eastern Carroll County moving into southern Cass County and a little thunder shower here near Romney and Linden in southern Montgomery County. These two cells, or three cells I suppose, have formed on a lake breeze front coming out of Lake Michigan today. These are forming on an old outflow boundary from storms in Missouri last night. So at least a couple of scattered storms this evening, but more importantly, I'm looking off to the west, seeing what's going to happen in Iowa this evening. You'll notice here in southern Iowa, a cluster of storms has popped. That's dropping south, or the big question is, is that the cluster the models are picking up on, or is another one going to form in Iowa? It's pretty unstable out here, and that will determine what happens in our weather tomorrow. If a cluster of storms forms up here in Iowa tonight with a severe threat and races eastward, moves through our area in the morning, our atmosphere will stabilize for the afternoon and we'll get through the afternoon fine. However, if nothing forms up here and this is the cluster, we'll see more of an afternoon thunderstorm event in our area tomorrow. So some ifs in the forecast, but bottom line is to keep it generic, some scattered storms tonight and tomorrow. Uh, we'll keep that potential in the forecast. So again, today temperatures in the 90s, a few locally enhanced storms by that lake breeze and outflow boundary. Tomorrow we'll watch Iowa and tonight and watch for the potential scattered storms tomorrow at 90, 92 on Friday, and then the potential of a line of storms coming in Saturday with a little more organized severe threat with highs running in the 90s. Tonight, though, forecast will drop to 72 degrees. At least a few scattered storms around, still muggy and still hot tomorrow. Sun and clouds mixed, humid with some scattered storms. Friday still looks hot with 92. Then storms on Saturday. Severe weather is possible. 92 for the high, cooler on Sunday. And then 84 on Monday and Tuesday. Looks to dry out before the heat and humidity and storms return by Wednesday. So the eyes are on Iowa this evening. That's what's going to determine what will happen in our area tomorrow morning. And